we are happy about that. Uh, it means that uh, our collaboration is good and successful and will continue. So uh, I have a plan to develop our football, our team, to make it better and better. We are young, we have the youngest team of the world, so it's already a good thing. The World Cup is coming very early for some of them, but I think we can do well. We have uh, a big motivation, we have a good spirit. It's always a pleasure to meet the team for our friendlies, for our training camps, and so I hope that we'll continue like that. Yes, we have good friendlies. It's important to play against teams who play similar football like the teams we have in our group. So, uh, Croatia, first game, we have Serbia. Uh, Iceland, second game, Poland. Very strong physically. Lewandowski, big players. We have um, Czech Republic, it's a very good team also. And uh, we played already Argentina in a friendly. We beat them, but it was perhaps not an advantage because now they will be very, very careful against us. But it's the third game, all will be possible in the third game. If they won the two first games, perhaps in the third game they will uh, change the team. So, you know, what we want to do is to come out of the group. We are supposed to, to be the fourth one, because in the draw we were in the first pot, in the fourth only. But we are outsiders, it's sure, but very ambitious outsiders. In the clubs, that they are fit, that they are playing regularly and that uh, they can maintain their level or are playing better. So what we want is to go from this uh, part of the group who brought us to the World Cup and to put in perhaps two or three players to make us better but uh, the competition is very very hard to come in the list of 23. Uh, we have at first a list of 35 and uh, so a second list uh, two weeks before the World Cup with 23. We want to have the best one, the fittest one and uh, also in the spirit who was our strengths all the time, a big solidarity. There are so big cities that we have a lot of fans here also and uh, we need a beach to have a high level football game, we need a good beach. And, uh, I didn't see yet a good pitch in Lagos. So we saw the governor in the night of the 1st of uh, January and he told us he's working on it. So uh, we want to play here, we want to play also in Abuja because it's the capital of the country. My wish was to start preparation in Nigeria to see uh, the families, the players will finish a long season in Europe they will come here, see the families, the fans can say goodbye and good luck to the team. They can bless the players and uh, the players will show that they are very committed to make a good World Cup. So if we can play in Abuja or Lagos, we will do. If not, because there is no pitch, we will go to Rio. About the fitness of the players, we are depending on the work they do with the drums. We will have them only for the friendlies a few days before our games or in our training camps. So the time is too short for us to make them fit for the World Cup. They must be fit already in the clubs. They must play, they must have good training sessions. And we have a very good relationship with the coaches of our players because uh, for example, uh, Arsene Wenger, we spoke about the problem with uh, Alexi Bobby in the last days. So uh, they're helping us 
uh, working for their players but also for us. And we can send, like the president said, uh, fitness coaches to help some players who are not playing enough to make them fit, to help the players, to help the clubs. So we are working together. And uh, of course, uh, our first list of 35 players must be done one month before the World Cup. So we can have uh, three players per position. And uh, it's also very important that the scouting of our players will be done very well. We have a scouting team, which is now with five or six uh, uh, assistants working on that and also working on the scouting of our opponents because they also will play. Russia will play in the United States against Peru on the 23rd of March, so we will see that also. And we will see also the other teams that we will be ready and we know very well against which players and which team we will play. Normally, every team gives a day after the games to see the families. Can be wives, can be children, or can, or can be uh, fancy. <laughs> I think uh, when you are together for six weeks or perhaps more, uh, you need also to see sometimes your wife and, uh, and for this possibility to permit them to see them after the games for a day. You, you give me already a lot of pressure. <laughs> we have the time for that, it will come. Uh, the most important now is to have a good preparation and to have uh, the fitness of our players. Uh, we bought the fitness equipment and now we can really control all about that. So, uh, about our World Cup. Uh, I'm happy to continue to work with this Nigerian team because I think we have also, like Coca-Cola said before, a family. And we have a very good relationship with the players and um, there is confidence and we have the youngest team of the world. So uh, the future will be bright. Uh, we have officials who let us work. We have partners who make our job easy, thank you very much, I tell you. And uh, so I think the conditions are good to make a good work. But you see that we were in pot number four, which <laughs> means that they suppose that we are the fourth in the group. And Iceland is third, Russia second and Argentina the first. So I think we have a good chance to come out of this group. We we can beat Iceland, I think. We can beat also Russia if we have a very good preparation. And we already showed that we can even beat the big Argentina, but it's not an advantage for us to have beaten them in the friendly. Because they will not underrate us now. So, uh, and after in the under 16, last 16, all is possible in one game. So let us dream to go on to the final and uh, we will see. I'm sure that the players will give the best. The staff is the same, big motivation and the people around us, we are all together. And that's why it's important that we can be in the first week of our preparation in Nigeria to show to the players how is the passion in the country and they will support them. For, for the games and uh, for the AFCON we will speak about it after. I think we can qualify, you know that uh, the new organization for the next AFCON is only in June 2019 and uh, there are two teams in each group will be qualified. So I think we can do that together with South Africa. We have to beat Libya. 
we have to beat uh, Seychelles. I think it should be possible. And uh, what we need is all the time to stay humble. And I hear the people speak on the road. They say we will be world champion. Even our president uh, says it. So I think we must stay humble, work very much, not speak too much, but work very much.